uh, these these are all the games that I picked up today. Everything that you see in front of you. I don't really know how much I spent for everything, but I can, uh, including this bucket, I can rattle off prices as I'm going through it. Uh, what I spent. It's a nice mix. I was actually very low on systems, so I'm happy with what I got today, even though some stuff is in pieces and parts. Um, what I'm going to do is start here, and I'm just going to go through the stuff that I got in this bucket I paid $50 for. I got an NES. The kid said it's working. It has a uh, duck hunt in it. Um, I believe this is complete. I'm just keep fishing through this bag. Okay, I got a gun, apparently. I got, let's see, a yellow bag. There's the power supply all taped up, fucked up looking. I don't care. I have power supply, so I can replace that. Um, another controller and cables. Okay, I'm moving past that. And like I said, I got all this for 50 bucks. Um, Jungle Book game, Sega Genesis in the case. Normally, I'm just going to fish the games out of the case. Unless they have considerable value, and I will give the cases to my friend to sell at the, uh, at the on eBay. Mrs. Pac-Man in the case. Got a PSP Harry Potter. Uh, and it is empty. Okay, just what I thought. Okay, no problem. Uh, like I said, 50 bucks for everything. Overall, it's a pretty damn good deal. Uh, got an X-Men. This might be a decent game. Might be eBayable. Uh, covers a little fucked up. Maybe I can switch it. Uh, let's see. Uh, Mickey Mania. This is an easy to sell game at the flea market. And, uh, well, it's in there. Let's see. Like I said, 50 bucks for everything. Uh, Pitfall. Let's see. I got this. This is N64. Part of the deal. Uh, but I think it came without anything. I think it came pretty much as is. But it has the red jumper pack, so it's already worth uh, ten bucks. And once I hook it, once I hook it up, because um, I have the parts, uh, it's thir I can sell it for thirty bucks. Okay, moving on. Let's see what else. I uh, got a Sega Two uh, controller screwed up, apparently. Uh, otherwise, it seems to be in okay cosmetic condition. Um, some kind of headphones, wires. I think it had the AV, and that's important. And, and then you can see I got some parts for uh, a GameCube, which is in there. I also got a GameCube, uh, and there's a game in there. What was a game? Let's see. Open. Um, Simpsons Road Rage. That's a pretty, pretty good game. That one's worth more. Uh, well, there's one of the controllers. There's the other one. Probably both of the controllers screwed up. That's right. I had controllers. Uh, here's a, this. The GameCube came with a official GameCube. And then a knockoff one. Here's some kind of foot thing. This I'll give to my friend. He could sell it um, on eBay because I'm not going to bother with it. Um, part of the deal, as you can see, it's a pretty da good damn deal for uh, 50 bucks. Also, in the deal included was a Super Smash Brother. I can get at least 20 for that. Maybe more. Uh, Contra, Hard Corpse, Sega Genesis. Might be available. I don't think I could sell it to Flea Market so much. Mortal Kombat 2, solid seller at the Flea Market, but I only sell most Sega Genesis games for, uh, I don't know, $4 or... Frogger. Okay, moving on. That was my 50 buck deal. Right, here we go. Oh, for $8. Um, I go up, I go, how much is uh, the Sega, the Game Boy? Well, actually, she said she had a, a Game Boy, so I'm like, oh, I'm interested in Game Boy. Um, of course, she didn't have it, but she had a Sega. Um, this doesn't work. The battery's all corroded. Initially, she was like 20 bucks, $2 or $3 a piece for games. And I'm like, oh, no, no, no. They're not worth that much. No. Can't sell them on eBay unless there's a rare one here. And I don't know if there is. So anyway, I got everything for $8. Because once it didn't work or the, she opened the batteries, it was totally corroded. She's like, ugh. Anyway, let me go through. Uh, I got an Asterix. World Cup Soccer. Desert Strike. Sega World Baseball. Olympic Gold. Shinobi Surf. I'm going to give these to my friend. I can't sell stuff like this at the flea markets I go to. Echo the Dolphin. Uh, Shinobi Game Gear. FIFA Saka. Some miscellaneous cables. And then here's the games that came with that. Uh, Outrun. Europa. Must be a driving game. Ren and Stimpy. Quest for the Shaving Yak. Uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Surf Ninjas. Uh, FIFA Saka. World Cup Soccer. Uh, Echo the Dolphin. Uh, as far as I know, none of these games have much value. World Series Baseball. I am literally just going to give all the Sega stuff to my friend, tell him to put it on eBay, Desert Strike, and sell it because they will not buy it from me at the Flea Wars. Asterix and The Great Rescue. I've never seen or heard of this game. Possibly that game has more value. And Shinobi 2, which I don't believe has much value on the uh, Sega Genesis. Oh, um, I had mentioned that I was buying stuff on eBay. Here's the second thing that I got. I kind of a beat-up label, but it is a Super Mario Advance. I uh, I think I can get 12 to 15. I paid 650 with shipping for this. I'm almost positive. Um, 
at another yard sale. I bought these games for $2 a piece, a Spyro Ripto's Rage, and then a Crash Bandicoot 2. Um, one case. Then I got this Legend of Dragoon. Possibly this is a good one. I have to look it up to know for sure. And I found a Sega Saturn. Man, I never get these games. Uh, Panzer Dragoon Zui? I don't know. Alright, uh, let's see. What else? Uh, oh, I got this. Uh, I At a different yard sale, I got this PS1 with uh, these games, and it's complete. Um, all the cables, memory card, paid 10 bucks, and I got a, it came test drive off-road, which I don't think is a very valuable game. Armored Core, not for me with this game, or I haven't had it in a while, may or may not be worth a little bit more. Uh, R4, Ridge Racer Type 4, I don't believe is worth that much. T2, Gran Turismo, has a little value, uh, and uh, Driver 2. Uh, let's see if there's anything in there. There's the, the ha other half of uh, the C2. At another yard sale, I got these cables. These come in handy. I paid a buck a piece. Whenever I get an NES, these fit right in. And uh, I can save the, the uh, NES AVs for, um, for when I get uh, a Sega Genesis 1. All right. Uh, for $50, and actually it was 60 It includes this, too. But for $50, I actually did pretty well here. And let me go through all this stuff. I'm just going to go through it because there's really no order to it. Um, this looks like the parts to a, what is it? It's a Handy Boy, and it looks like a magnifier light to uh, an original Game Boy. Then I got some uh, Game they're kind of beat up, but I got a, original Game Boy things. And like I said, I just give these to my friend. He lots and puts them on eBay, and that's why I don't have to deal with selling them at the flea market. Uh, Marvel Madness. Alleyway. Battletoads, maybe. Has some value. Tetris. Game Boy Quicks, not for me with that game. T2, game shouldn't have too much value. Maybe the uh, instructors do Nemesis. Bart Simpsons, Escape from Camp Deadly. Uh, tennis, Lock and, Ch Lock and Chase. Cleaning Kit, Super Mario Land 2 and, and the Golden Cone, Super Mario Land. Uh, Buzz Bugs Bunny. Turtles, Fall of the Foot Clan. Game Boy. Uh, the Castlevania Adventure, hmm, maybe. Uh, compact video system, instruction booklet, some miscellaneous papers, and another booklet for the Game Boy. Let's see what we got in here. Hmm, I got a rechargeable, an AC charger for it, pretty cool. I got a Game Genie. I can most likely only sell this on eBay. I'm going to give it to my friend, he'll sell it. Oh, here's a, a Handy Boy joystick, so you can put it on the game and work it like an arcade. Okay, going on to the next box. Now this I got all for $50 and I've just showed you I've just shown you, um, well here you go, here's the box for the Game Genie um, here's the Game Boy there it is and I don't know if it's working, oh and there's also a game in there uh, Nemesis, not familiar with that game here's some little booklets for the Game Genie so I'll stick those in the box nice to have the box and stuff like that, that is definitely an eBayable item and it goes straight to my friend uh, what's this? I don't really know what it'll go for, though. Uh, and this also works with the Game Genie. Okay. Uh, I got another one of these. I can definitely sell these. I'll clean it up a little, but I can definitely sell these for $10 at the flea market. You know, I, I ask, uh... S12, sell for 10 Um, and then the games I got are pretty much the same ones as were in the catalog. Escape from Camp Deadly. But I also got these little, uh, great cases. I give them to my friend. He sells them on... Uh, eBay gets at least a dollar piece. The Castlevania Adventure it looks like the kid stuck this sticker all over. I want to see if I can get that off. Um, Marble Madness, Quicks. Hmm, a cleaning kit. Maybe that has value. Don't know. Uh, Tetris. Let me get. I think my shadows never. Motocross Maniacs. Tennis. Uh, alleyway. Uh, Lock and Chase. Not familiar with those games. Uh, Jurassic Park. Most of these games I would sell at a flea market for like $4, uh, 2 for 7 3 for 10 T2 for Terminator. Uh, Final Fantasy Legend 2, possibly that has more value. Uh, Battletoads in Ragnarok's World. I've ne I don't believe I've ever had a Battletoads for the NES, so uh, we'll have to see about that. Some kind of personal notes. Uh, another piece for that Game Genie box. Alright. Uh, possibly this is a decent game. I, I gotta check that one out. Um, Super Mario Land. I can get $8 for that. That's a number two. Uh, don't know what this is. And I... Oh, I got it open. Let's see. And it's got tape on it. Uh, Bugs Bunny. Alright. Apparently had all kind of notes and stuff for that. Um, continuing on. 
Let's see, what's this? Super Mario Land, the original. I can get eight bucks for that. Mario Combat. And, and then here's the Turtles Fall of the Foot Club. Uh, all right, I'm almost done, and I'm just, I'll talk about the, the best thing last, I think. Uh, Sega Game Gear, it does not work. And I plugged it in and tried it. Uh, plug for it, and I actually paid 10 for this because it has a case which is in pretty good shape. And again, I think I'm going to give my friend all this stuff. I got uh, 10, 18 into everything Sega that I let him lot it, and he'll make what he makes. A Majors Pro Baseball, a, a BS game, Sonic Chaos, Chaos. Uh, Sonic 2, and another Echo the Dolphin. Alright, um, this is probably the best thing I got. This is odd, because I did not see the actual item, uh, so I don't know if I have it, whatever, but I got this box. It's a game something, playtime. Maybe that has value. Um, and this is probably the most, well, one of the most valuable things I, I got today, and I never really get these. I save the best for last. This is a game and watch, multi-screen Donkey Kong. Um, it's not pristine. It has been played with. That's a little stuff. But I've got a box, which even though it's beat up, I mean, I never see boxes. The original styrofoam insert, a little piece of paperwork uh, about batteries and stuff. And then while the cover, which you may see, does have some scuffs and scratches on it. And also, I don't know if it works yet. Um, there it is. The inside looks pretty clean. Uh, a little bit of, I think this could be cleaned up in the back. Stick a couple batteries in it if it works. You know, I'm not sure. It could be worth 50, 75, 100. Um, I only had these once, and it was in better condition, but I didn't have the box. So who knows? I'll know later uh, tonight. But that is everything and uh, games I got today.